Hi, this is Callie Binkowski, and this short video will show you how to edit a voice thread assignment you have already submitted. This was filmed in February of 2015. If you are watching it later than that, the versions might be slightly different, but the steps should be similar enough that you can figure it out. Let's go ahead and get started. So here I am in a Moodle site, and this is the voice thread assignment that I was required to do. I'm going to choose that. And when I get there, I'll get this window. Sometimes it'll show you immediately which one you submitted. What you need to do is know which one you already submitted for it. And I happen to know I submitted this for this assignment. And as you look, you'll see you have a few options here. You could try and submit it again. If you do that, it'll tell you you already submitted. So now you know it's there. Um, there's an option here to share with class. Don't choose that unless you're supposed to be sharing your assignments. Things you're supposed to be working on on your own, you should never choose that. What you want to go to to edit is we'd go to Preview. Preview will take you into VoiceThread and it will show you your VoiceThread and it'll play through the different comments. Um, at this point you could rearrange the comments so they're in a different order. You could delete the comments you don't want. You could add new comments. One of the other things that you can do is you can go down here on the right hand side there's a stack of all your slides it'll show you everything and you can add new things here so when i click on the plus it gives me a chance to do some navigation and i can go find the documents that i wanted to dump in oh and i just double click it to get it to add. And so you can add more documents. And once you've added more documents, you can add more comments. So you can't delete things up here in this slides, but you can add more slides to it if you want. When I'm all done, um, I'm going to close, but I wanted to show you over here quick first. There's places here where you can share this voice thread. Um, ah, edit will take you to a place where you can delete individual slides. So let's say I didn't want that one. I can get rid of it. Um, let's see. So I'm going to go ahead now and head back to my original, which is right here. Now I'm back in my Moodle. I've previewed it and I've changed it. I don't need to submit again because it's already been changed. Be aware that if you do make changes after your instructor has graded it, chances are they will not be going back to grade it again. So be sure you do it before your deadlines. And if you want to get back to your main page, you just click there and you are all done. Thanks so much.